Red FM. Oh, we're very disappointed. Um, I think you know we were all delighted with the, with the year we had last year, and um, you know we came over here to to attack them and, and to, to really have a go and and, and come away with a win. Um, and obviously it didn't happen, and and we're very disappointed with that. To go 17-3 down at half time, what could you have done at that point? Do you think to get yourselves back into the game? Um, yeah, we, we put them under a lot of pressure just before going the final or the the half time whistle, and you know we nearly got over two or three times, and, and that was I suppose that was difficult to, to come away at, at half time and and uh, you know not close that margin. Um, because it would have been would have been a lot you know it would have been certainly kept us in the game a bit, uh, that much more and would have um, you know got us going again um, once once the French I suppose get a bit of a margin in in, in the scoreboard then they tend to play uh, a little bit more uh, risky rugby and, and nine times out of ten it seems to be coming away, coming off for them over here um, but uh, yeah I think obviously we we had individual errors. Um, Myself included, and, and uh, you know, at times where maybe we had turnovers, um, you know, we might knock the ball on, and, and that happened a few times. And um, I think maybe in pivotal t- points of the game, we, we made mistakes. Um, but um, you know, I think we, we just have to learn from today and, and, and <coughs> regroup and and and, uh, and see what we, we can uh, change going forward and into the into going over to Twickenham. Is it time for a full reappraisal of things, or is it just slight modifications? No, certainly not. I mean, I think there was. I mean, we can take a lot of positives out of, out of today, or a few positives out of today. You know, our set piece was very good. I think our lineup was very good. Um, we mauled them well at times. We we scrummed very well. Um, uh, at times our breakdown was, was very good too, and we, we didn't let them uh, disrupt too much. Um, but you know, we I think certainly the the errors and, and maybe um, um, you know d- defensively, obviously we we left to look as well and, and tighten up things in certain areas. Um, but I think we learn a lot uh, from this loss, and, and I think the, the physicality of today was, was was certainly huge, and I think that'll help us going forward, and, uh, and you know makes a better team. It's been a while since an Irish team has had to deal with a dark day. I suppose it's about how you react now, because it's one thing going on a winning run, but I guess another to respond to this. Yeah, I think we've we built up a, a, a you know very good work ethic and and very good standards in, in the Irish team and. and uh, I think that's why it hurts even more, you know. Um, you know, we we definitely came over with with the mindset of, of going attacking and, and, and winning this game, and um, you know the scoreline definitely hurts. But you know, all credit to France, they they played very well. They, you know, they they got over the game line well. They kept the scoreboard ticking over, dropped goals, and um, you know made made life very difficult for us. What about England in a couple of weeks? Now? It's obviously, as you mentioned, there getting these get yourselves back up off the floor. And Ready for two weeks. Yeah, um, yeah. I suppose it's it's, um, it's, a, it's, a, it's the next thing we have to focus on. But I suppose we we, we got to learn and and, and, and an, analyze the uh, the game today, and um, you know see what we have to change and, and, uh, and where we need to improve um, because it's, it's going to be a very uh, difficult trip over to Twickenham. You're happy enough with your own try today. There was a, maybe a hint of a forward pass about it. Um, I never saw that forward pass anyway. Um, yeah, obviously uh, happy, but I think in the circumstances, you know, and not, yeah, you couldn't really celebrate or, you know, um, it won't be the overriding memory from today, but um, it's always nice to score. Was there still a chance to come into it at that stage? I think there, all, there always was, yeah. Um, you know, we, I, we, I think it was the game two years ago when we were here where, you know, we were down a lot of points uh, after half time. Um, you know, we, I think we played quite well that that first half, but they had just, you know, uh, the France, uh, the French in France, um, you know, got scores from, from, you know, it seemed to create them out of nothing. Um, but you know, we, we stuck in there. We, we we played a good high tempo game, and we, you know, we, we, we put them under the cash and we nearly nearly snuck it in the end. So, yeah, there was definitely this, you know, that mentality again today, um, where we're, we're putting a lot of phases together and. and Challenge in in there 22, um, but you know it's, it's the the odd error or turnover and and then, and then you lose momentum. Yeah, it was uh, I suppose the broken field running from those turnovers and stuff that really killed you. I mean the attack that led to Keane getting the yellow card was pretty much against the run of play at that stage. Yeah, but that's that's why they're so dangerous here. I think you know you you can, you can be attacking, you can be attacking, and, and one turnover and they they're very dangerous. Um, uh, and uh, yeah, they certainly weren't today. Red, Red FM. FM.
FM.